Okay, it's that time. Are you starting to think about your spring cleaning? I know I am too. Have you thought about spring cleaning your finances? Well, Andre Bulldog's here to do all that with us today. Uh, Andre, where, what's your title? Where do you come from today? I'm a senior vice president with uh, BDO Debt Solutions, and mm -hmm. I'm a licensed insolvency trustee. Okay, so for people that don't know what that term means, walk us through what that means. Um, it means uh, that people that are overwhelmed with debt come to see me, and we find solutions for them mm -hmm. to get them out of debt. Mm -hmm. And uh, we also provide... Uh, credit counseling, budget counseling, and all, all that fun financial stuff. And, you know, when I think about debt, I think about how it might be weighing someone down. Are you a solution to that? Uh, yes, we are. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, you know, either by doing um, a consumer proposal most of the time or mm -hmm. bankruptcy, or sometimes people just need a little bit of help with their budget. Mm -hmm. We can do that as well. Because it can cause relationship stress. It can cause, you know, you're up in the middle of the night thinking about it. Uh, so where should we start? It, it springs, well, we've, we've officially hit spring. We yes. haven't had really a spring day yet. Uh, but, but how can we start uh, spring cleaning our finances? Well, three areas. First, uh, it's income tax season as well. Mm -hmm. So uh, a lot of people don't do their taxes on time or they delay. So... Uh, my message is don't delay, get them done. Most people get a small refund, then it triggers you getting uh, GST, HST mm -hmm. uh, credits, and also for the uh, Climate uh, Action Incentive Plan uh, payment. Mm -hmm. um, you need to do your taxes to get that. And whoever in the household does their taxes first gets that payment, so a little added oh. incentive. <laughs> That's good to know. Yes. That's great. And the uh, second thing is uh, people should look at decluttering their budget or spending. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, in areas such as uh, streaming services, right? You really need four or five of them if you're only watching one. Mm. And at 10 bucks a service over a year, it's like 600 bucks if you have five of them. And it's just not uh, TV or movies, you know, it could be radio and music and all those mm. kinds of things. Mm -hmm. Same things with other subscriptions, whether it be a gym membership you're not using. Mm -hmm. I mean, cut it out of your budget, it really adds up. Mm -hmm. um, Another area is uh, look at how much you're paying in insurance, you know, for the car or the house. Mm -hmm. Can you get a better deal? Um, also look at your internet and mobile plans. People spend a lot of money there. They tend to creep up. Mm -hmm. And lastly, get rid of inactive bank accounts that you're paying bank fees on. Look at banking for free. You shouldn't have to pay banking fees. You know, look at what's available. And look at the, um, the charges you get on your credit card. Like, don't pay for insurance you don't need for overdraft or uh, credit monitoring and I'll speak a bit about that later. Mm -hmm. Actually let's let's talk about credit monitoring cuz I I just went through a process I, I sold a house I bought a new house so my credit rate uh, rating and report was so important to me through that process. Yes. Do you think Canadians really know what that process is and and really understand credit rates? Uh, more and more but mm -hmm. I think people could do more. It's never been easier to uh, see your credit report and to understand it. Mm -hmm. So um, people should, should take it out at least mm -hmm. annually. So you can get that for free from Equifax. There's mm -hmm. two credit bureaus. So Equifax, you can go on, sign up for free, see, your, see everything that's on there, see your mm -hmm. score. You can also do that with TransUnion. Mm -hmm. Once a month, it's free. Also with uh, BMO, Scotiabank and Royal, you can get your TransUnion report there if mm -hmm. you look deep enough. And with CIBC, you can get the Equifax. Also, <laughs> uh, there's uh, fintechs out there. Uh, Credit mm -hmm. Karma, they're linked to TransUnion. Oh, okay. And Borowell, they're linked to Equifax. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's free. You know, they get your information. They try to sell you services. Just be aware of that. Mm -hmm. um, but, but you'll get notifications, right, when there's a new inquiry in your account, there's a change of address and things like that. So mm -hmm. you can look out for identity theft or yeah. that type of stuff, I right? I was just thinking that, yeah. actually, yeah. Absolutely. And all that's free, right? Mm -hmm. So you don't have to pay for that. Mm -hmm. Really important. And, you know, the, the role that you play, you know, you might be changing a family's life in your, in your job. Do you, do you kind of take that on and that's a responsibility that you have? Oh, absolutely. And mm -hmm. everyone that works uh, for BDO, I mean, they take pride in the work they do and being able to make a difference. It's really nice to have solutions and yet people in their way uh, mm -hmm. in the right direction financially. Mm -hmm. um, of course, you know, we try to deal with the burden of debt they may be dealing with and mm -hmm. finding solutions for that. But we also provide counseling and all that useful advice in terms of budgeting. And, you know, going forward, where do you go from there once mm -hmm. you're debt free? Right. And, you know, when I think about my high school days, I wish they would have taught us financial literacy. I wish they would have taught us how to do our taxes. Uh, how, how important is it for us to, to not procrastinate and, and sort of learn the, these life skills? 
Well, you know what they say, time is money. Yeah. <laughs> the more you procrastinate, you know, the further behind you get and the less runaway you have. So, you know, the sooner you live within your means, you know, the sooner you can start tackling your debt. Mm -hmm. And then I always say the next step is to live below your means, which means you're saving money. That's the only way you'll build mm -hmm. retirement savings or uh, an emergency fund mm -hmm. and, and not be dependent on credit if something mm -hmm. happens, mm -hmm. right? Because you have that emergency fund or those mm -hmm. retirement funds. So. We only have about a minute, but you know, I think about somebody maybe reaching out to you or reaching out to somebody for this service. There's no shame in it. Absolutely not. Mm -hmm. um, that's the thing I get most from people. It's mm -hmm. like, oh, it wasn't as bad as I thought. Mm -hmm. I should have reached out sooner. Yeah. And people do have a lot of sleepless nights. Mm -hmm. That stress is real. And oftentimes people will struggle with this for months, mm -hmm. even you know, a year mm -hmm. before they pick up the phone and ask for help. Mm -hmm. And it's free for initial consultation. Oh, that's good to yeah. know. That's good to know. I learned a lot from you today. Thank you so much. This is a topic that, you know, unless you sort of uh, immerse yourself into it, you may not know. And I, th I think you right. shared a lot of great tips today. Thank you so much. Andre Bulldog joining us today from BDO. Uh, great opportunity there uh, to talk about uh, are your finances and, and debt and, of course, those taxes. We have till May 1st this year uh, just because uh, April 30th uh, lands on a Sunday. We have one more day, but, but don't wait. Don't wait. Get it done. Uh, I'm Sam LaPrade filling in for Derek Fage. Come on back, everyone.